Thank you for buying an Intex Small Rectangular Metal Frame Above Ground Pool. Setting it up is simple and easy. This video will give you a quick overview of your new Intex Small Rectangular Metal Frame Pool and how to set it up. There are also important detailed instructions in your owner's manual. Watching this video will help you visualize details of the pool setup. The pool shown is the 2.6 meter by 1.6 meter by 65 centimeter small rectangular metal frame pool. Your pool parts may differ in number and type or color depending on your model. Assembly requires two people. No tools are needed. Lay out the content of the carton. Open the carton carefully so you can reuse it to store your pool. Check that you have all the parts listed in your manual. Do not assemble the pool if parts are damaged or missing. For replacement parts, please visit our website at www.intexcorp.com. It is important to determine ahead of time where to set up your pool since the pool cannot be moved once it is filled with water. Follow these guidelines. Set up your pool on a completely level surface. Do not set up on mud, sand, or loose soil. Failure to set up the pool on level compact ground may result in the pool being unstable and leaning to one side when filled with water. Do not place the pool against a house, wall, or fence. The pool should be within reach of an electrical outlet. Envision the traffic patterns around the pool when determining where to place the filter pump so people will not trip on the electric cord. Do not plug the pump into an electrical outlet until you have finished setting up both the pool and the pump. Follow these electrical guidelines. Ensure that the pool is at least 3.5 meters from any electrical outlet. You must be able to plug in the pump into an electrical outlet without using an extension cord. Electrical outlets must be GFCI or RCD protected. Check local requirements. Some communities require fencing or wall enclosures. Before unrolling the pool, clear the area of any objects that might puncture the liner and avoid dragging it in place. Carry your pool to your chosen location. Never drag the pool across the ground. You may damage the liner and cause leaks. Unroll the pool. Make sure the pool is right side up and let the liner warm in the sun for easier assembly. Look for the pool connection holes and rotate the pool so they will face the filter pump. Lay out all the horizontal beams around the pool. The longer side of the rectangular metal frame pool uses two beams labeled A and one beam labeled B. The number of B beams on one side depends on the size of your pool. See the manual for the number corresponding to your pool. The shorter side of the pool uses one beam labeled C and one beam labeled D. Lay out the parts to be assembled around the pool. Starting with the longer side, slide the A-beams first into the sleeve openings located in each corner. Continue with B-beam snapping into the A-beam. Insert the beam through the T-joint at each liner sleeve middle opening. For the shorter side, slide the C-beam first into the opening. Insert the beam through the T-joint at the liner sleeve middle opening. Connect the corner joints to the horizontal beams at the four corners. Secure the joints with the pins by inserting them into the pre-drilled holes. Connect the vertical corner legs to the corner top rail joints and attach the legs end cap to the bottom of the vertical leg. Connect the side legs to the T-joints. Pull the restrainer straps out from under the liner. Stretch the restrainer straps towards the matching side support legs. Hook the respective sleeves of the restrainer strap to the base of the side support legs. Link the liner straps and the restrainer straps on the other three walls. Now check your work. The corners should be properly aligned and locked into place. 
The restrainer straps should be pulled as far from the pool as possible. Locate the drain plugs and make sure they are firmly closed with the cap screwed on snugly, hand tighten only. Put a small amount of water in the pool to cover the bottom. This will let you check if the pool is level. If it is not level, you must change the location or grade the area under the pool. Do not add any more water at this time. If your pool was purchased without a filter pump, locate the optional black filter pump outlets and insert the strainer hole plug. Resume filling the pool. As the pool fills with water, make sure the legs are snug against the pool wall. Do not fill the pool beyond the sleeve seam. Once the pool is filled, there should be no object within 1.2 meters of the pool that a child can climb on to enter the pool. Post the pool safety sign included with your pool where it will be seen by all pool users. Congratulations, you have successfully set up your Intex small rectangular metal frame pool. If you purchased a filter pump with this pool, please continue to the filter pump videos where you can select the filter pump appropriate for your pool.